Oh yeah, that's that's really nice and shiny. Kind of gives me like a like a glossy vibe with the uh, with the platinum camel. So W. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out the Heartbreaker tracers. <gasps> so well, what's up, guys? Enter here by Nino Orquaji, and welcome back to another video of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer and Warzone 2, and I guess DMZ as well. We got a special store bundle to show you guys off today, and today we're recovering the Tracer Pack Ballistic Love Bundle. This comes with pink tracer rounds and apparently a love potion death effect, which sounds really freaking amazing. It comes with tracers for the crossbow, the MX-9, a really freaking buff operator skin, and probably some other cool stuff as well. If you guys are excited to see how camels look like on the tracer guns, if you guys are excited to see the tracers themselves and the death effect, you guys are excited to see the operator skin, and anything secretive about this bundle, I will pretty much cover on this video. So if you guys are excited for all that, make sure you guys drop a like on the video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. On this channel, I upload store bundles that are in, I'm interested in, so like tracer packs, any other sort of store bundles that are interesting, maybe Mastercrafts, Ultra Skins, if they come out with that in the future, and all that. So if that sounds good to you, make sure you guys are subscribed so you guys don't miss out on future content. Also, I do upload Warzone 2 class video videos from time to time, as well as news videos. So if any of that sounds good to you, I'd love having your time here. Anyways, without further ado, Let's go ahead and rock and roll with this new bundle. Damn, it comes with a lot of stuff. First off, we got the operator skin for Reyes, known as Snack. And yeah, it's it's a freaking Reyes, just looking freaking buff. This is perfect for any girl, or you know, any guy that, that leans that way. And he looks pretty great. My man is freaking buff as hell, and he's ready to freaking show everybody his love with that freaking uh, crossbow, which also looks pretty crazy. So yeah, not a bad operator skin, if you like to lean that way, or you just like his appearance. If I stay on the screen too much longer, I think my girlfriend's gonna get mad at me, so let's keep it moving. Next up, we got our first tracer blueprint for the crossbow, which just came out uh, yesterday, and it comes with pink tracer rounds and the death effect of love potion. And this looks really freaking sweet. As you guys can see, these are the attachments that it comes with, and it freaking has tracer rounds. I love the little angel or whatever they have there, the, the cupid boy, I guess you wanna say, and uh, really good detail on the gun as well, so. Let me know if you guys are excited for this, uh, to see how the crossbow is in-game. Next up, the gun that I'm interested in is the MX-9 Heartbreaker Blueprint, which also comes with pink tracer rounds, but it comes with a different death effect known as Heartbreak. And it's a pretty much an all-pink sort of gun. As you guys can see, it has, like, some shades of blue in the middle there, which I think is really clean looking. Oh yeah, you guys probably want to see the attachment. Here are the attachments, in case you guys were wondering. Uh, so it doesn't come with any ammunition, sadly, so you can't change the ammunition. And you can't put these tracers on any other guns, so this will only be for the MX-9. But uh, it looks really freaking, I don't know, it looks nice and glossy. I think camos are going to look really nice with this gun, so can't wait to see it in-game. Next up, we got the Roses and Riptides vehicle skin, which is uh, this is how it looks like. We've got the Crush weapon charm. We also have a Cupid weapon charm, which looks kind of funny if you ask me. We also have the Cupid's upgrade weapon sticker. Would have been nice if it was a decal. Uh, Lovers and Fighters loading screen. And the emblem known as Be Mine. And it legit says Modern Warfare 2. And a little heart, I guess, bursting. That's kind of funny. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and cop this bundle right now. Let's go ahead and cop it. I'm going to show you everything off in game as well as in the menu to see how the camels look like. So if you guys are excited for that, stay tuned. Anyways. Let's rock and roll. So here we have both the Lovemaker Crossbow and the Heartbreaker MX-9. Before going over them, I just wanted to show off the charms. We got the Crush, and we've got the Cupid. Cupid looking kind of funny at me, bro. Yeah! Oh no. And in case you guys are wondering about the stickers, this is how they, they look like, basically. They kind of, I guess they kind of add to the gun. I don't think so, though. And here's how the stickers look like on the MX-9. Okay, so here we have the beautiful crossbow, and let's go ahead and see how it looks like with camo, see if there's anything of like a, like a huge difference, so... Yeah, putting on the original camo doesn't really seem to do much, probably be different with the solid color camos, but here's how gold looks like, here's how platinum looks like, here's how polyatomic looks like, and here's how Orion looks like. Most likely the cases, like the whole Cupid thing was probably gone, yeah, you guys can see, you can barely see the man, uh, he's just like, in the very, very dark cusps of things so it's just better to have the original design than to put on a camo if you care about the design at all or you can just put on a camo you know whatever way you roll and here are the cdl camos it covers the entire gun entirely and now here we've got the good old mx9 with these specific attachments you know the attachments that it comes with and uh when you go to the camos this is how it mixes with the regular camo doesn't look like anything too special yet here we got gold here we got platinum 
Yo, Platinum actually looks really nice with this gun. It, like, becomes translu translucent with the blueprint. That is actually super freaking clean. Holy crap. So, if you have Platinum on the MX-9, definitely rock that with this blueprint. It actually makes, like, a like a, like a a really big difference. You guys saw that. Like, you, you guys know this is not Platinum, how Platinum originally looks like. So, that's good. Polyatomic kind of looks nice, too. It gives a little bit of difference within the, uh, the purple, you know, base of the gun. And here is Orion. So, yeah, the, the, the Platinum and Polyatomic camos are good on this gun. When it comes to solid color camos, uh, I think there's, like, a little difference with the solid color camos, but it's not, not going to be anything too major. I think they do look a little bit nicer with solid color camos than usual. And here are these CDL camos, which there's no big difference with. But definitely Polyatomic and Platinum, those are the, the camos you want to use here if you want to have, like, a super unique look. In fact, let me let me see it in game because I have the actual like I have the actual camo myself. So let's see. Oh yeah, that's that's really nice and shiny. Kind of gives me like a like a glossy vibe with the uh, with the platinum camo. So W. Okay, so now that we've seen how these guns look like with their base attachments, what do they look like with their meta class setups? So here's the base blueprint of the Lovemaker crossbow. And here's the Lovemaker with meta attachments. As you can see, you lose a lot of stuff, but that's only because of the stock that I used. I prefer this stock because it gives you a huge advantage, but honestly, you could use the original stock that it comes with because it doesn't have bad effects. That actually allows you to move around faster. I just prefer the faster ADS speed, but if you don't need the faster ADS speed, which honestly, you probably don't, uh, you could actually use the base stock that it comes with, and you can still keep the design. So you can use this meta class setup and still keep the design, which is really nice. And this should serve you well. So here's the base blueprint of the MX-9 Heartbreaker. And here's how it looks like with meta attachments. So it still pretty much keeps its original base design. You know, there's going to be a difference with the muzzle and the barrel and stuff. But everything else is pretty much the same, which is actually pretty sweet. But yeah, now that we covered everything about the guns in the menus, let's go ahead and get into a game. Go ahead and show you guys how the operator looks like in game a little bit. And of course, see how crazy this love potion death effect is and the pink tracers. Let's rock and roll. Okay, so to start things off, here we have the MX-9 uh, Heartbreaker, I believe it was called. It looks really clean here in the nice light. Here's how the the sight looks like. It's got a little heart on it. Actually, has a nice little zero next to it. I think that's the amount of kills you might get with this. I'm about to analyze that later. And then here we have the crossbow, which looks really beautiful as well. Actually, you know what? Let me, let me actually check something. I don't usually have music on, but I heard from a little bird or on the streets that this might have music on the gun. Okay, now that I have the music on, let's go ahead and check out this blueprint, see if it has music. It actually plays freaking music, bruh. That is actually crazy. So yeah, this is the first blueprint in Model Warfare 2 that has music. It also comes with this nice little heart reticle on the scope as well, so. Really, really freaking cool. And now it's for the main event. You actually shoot freaking heart tracer rounds. Look at that, bro. Oh, let's go here. Oh my goodness. You have pink heart tracers for the MX-9. How about the crossbow? Let's see how this looks like. <laughs> it legit shoots out freaking gas grenade freaking tear gas. I'm guessing you, in order to keep the tracers for the crossbow, you need to have the, the bolt with the gas. Because this that is an ammunition actually. So that is something to keep in mind. You have to run the tear grass gas with the crossbow, I think. But we'll we'll find out, I guess, uh, in a bit. But that's actually really cool. Let's see how it looks like on an opponent. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out the Heartbreaker Tracers. <gasps> There's actually a heart that pops up in blood after you body your opponent. That's a really nice death effect. I loved it when I saw the, these types of things in Marvel 2019, like for the Saw Bundle. That is dope. And you guys see the nice little heart effect when you body somebody. That's actually really freaking sweet. Wow. Now, if the MX-9 had that effect, what if the crossbow has an, has a, has an effect? Let's find out. Wait, no, wait. Oh, there's something. There is something that is said, but that's a really nice freaking gas grenade sort of uh, kill. Let's go ahead and get into a clearer ground so we can see the death effect better. Okay, so here we are on clearer ground, and now let's see the effect. 
That is such a dope effect. And when they disappear, you actually see XOXO. So you have an XOXO death effect. And then you have the heart death effect with the MX-9. This bundle is a huge W. Probably the best bundle we've gotten so far, if anything. Plus we got freaking heart tracers. And the freaking uh, tear gas bolt. Let me go ahead and pull out my other crossbow class without the, uh, the tear gas. And see if it still does the potion or whatever. Which, if it doesn't, that really sucks. But it's understandable at the same time. <clears throat> There's a little sound when you spawn in with the crossbow. I don't know if you guys heard it, but it was a nice little harp playing. It was very faint, though. Okay, let's see. Is there is, is there effect? I don't think there is an effect. Hold on, let's try to kill him. Yeah, so you only get the effect when you're running the tear gas on the on the crossbow. So that kind of stinks. If you're buying this for the crossbow, you are going to be using, in my opinion, the worst bolt because because uh, uh, the tear gas isn't that good, in my opinion, unless you don't care. So that's something to think about. And with my own class, as you guys see, you still have the the tracers slash effect, which is really cool. Now I'm just going to do a finishing move so we can see how he looks like. Ooh, my man looks freaking buff out here, bro. Look at him go. Freaking big baller out here. But yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go to a... Uh, let's do a third person game real quick and then we can finish off the video. Okay, so here we are in third person mode and our boy uh, Reyes is looking pretty sweet, man. He's a buff dude. Looking, uh, looking great. Ready to steal some hearts out here, literally. <laughs> heart stealer, heart breaker. Steal some hearts and break them. You know, that's, uh, that's what he's, he's gonna do. Also, I was curious, does it, does it give us a kill effect? Oh, there's a nice little... Yeah, it actually tells you how many kills you get with the gun. As you guys saw right there, on the side of the scope. I forgot to inspect that uh, in the first person gameplay, but that's actually pretty cool. You can keep track of your, your kills and stuff, but... Yeah, that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Uh, this crossbow... Pretty dope for the fact that it can actually uh, play music. Actually, before we end, let me make sure. Let me see if we can uh, actually hear the music with a regular. With, if I change up the attachments to my meta class setup. Let's do that real quick, just to, for sakes. Yeah, no matter what attachments you have on the on the crossbow, because this is my own meta crossbow class, uh, it will actually will play the music. So that's good if you don't care for the. Uh, for the whatchamacallit, for the tracer effect. But I mean, the tracer effect is what matters here. So it's up to you. But yeah, I think it's an overall W bundle. Obviously there's some, you know, miscommunications when it comes with the tear gas bolts. But honestly for the MX-9 and the operator skin and everything that's in this bundle and the effects, W bundle. But it's only if you really like the MX-9. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe to your channel, post notifications. We upload the best sort of store bundle reviews here on the channel. And of course, Warzone 2 gameplay. You guys have been the best viewers ever. Thank you for changing my life every single day. And without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. Keep being big ballers. I love you all. Let me know if you guys are copping this bundle in the comment section below. Uh -huh.